Night Lights, sponsored by Isabella Bank. Hey everyone and welcome to our week eight edition of Friday Night Lights and don't look now but there's only two regular season weeks left. That's right Mark several local teams looking to stay unbeaten and improve to eight and oh we have got to get to those games and we have double digit highlights coming your guys's way. In addition to that we'll show our WNEM play of the night and announce our three finalists for next Friday's game of the week. Certainly a jam packed show for you tonight and a lot of close games so let's get to it. Friday Night Lights Game of the Week, sponsored by Genesee Health Plan. A massive undefeated showdown. 7-0 Frankenmuth taking on 7-0 Freeland. Big time crowd on hand. 14-7 Eagles. Jake Medeva going to launch one to Wilson Huckabee for the touchdown. It's 14 all at the half. Freeland would then take the lead in the third quarter. Keenan Cooper going to go through the pile and punch it in. Falcons would miss the PAT though. So it's 20 to 14. Frankenmuth answers fourth quarter. Logan Diener dives in. It's 20-20, which makes this point after try important. Aiden Lava Senior puts it through. It's 21-20 with four minutes left. Freeland going to try to answer on the rollout, but the pass is intercepted by Hagen Washer. Frankenmuth would run out the clock from there in an instant classic. Eagles take down Freeland 21-20. Let's stay in the TVC. Garber traveling to take on Bridgeport. The Duke's going to hand it off to Dominic Nizek. He finds a seam and darts into the end zone. Garber in control, but the Bearcats fight back. A nice screen pass to Lamarian Moore. He, the senior going to break a tackle and off to the races. Down the sideline for a massive game for Bridgeport. But Garber would prove to be too much. Ethan Pett. With time, going to find Cade Wallacher for the touchdown as the Dukes get the win 37 to 6. Now to the Saginaw Valley League. Davison hosting Grand Blank. Winner of this matchup takes home the SVL South regular season title. Second quarter, Jake Morrow is going to look to heave this one downfield. A long pass, but it's going to be intercepted by Trayton Hato. Davison now back with the ball. Jackson Dosh is going to roll out, throwing this one on the run. An absolutely beautiful deep pass to the CMU commit. Braylon Naves for a 50-yard game. That set up the go-ahead TD for Davison. And after halftime, Grand Blake would take over. Morrow has time to evade. He evades the pressure, steps up, finds Gerald Clement wide open. He's got green grass ahead for the touchdown. Grand Blake gets the upset win on the road, 55-49. Staying in the Saginaw Valley League, Carmen Ainsworth took on Saginaw United. Both squads looking for their first conference win this season. The Phoenix Jordan Allen takes a three-step drop and finds Jabari Washington down the middle, stiffs on the tackler and drags another into the end zone for a touchdown as United adds on to their lead. Allen again looks, and this time he goes for the long ball downfield. Only problem is that Cavalier catches this ball as Jaden Green gets the interception. Fourth and 25, United goes for it. Allen loads up and fires it downfield. This time, TJ Stevenson comes down with a touchdown as Say United picks up the win 34 to 26. Now to an SVL crossover. Dow meeting up with Lapeer tonight. We pick things up in the first half. Cameron Vanacek is going to fake the give, throwing off his back foot. Finds Talon Sumner for the sideline. Touchdown. He's in to make it a 7 0 lead for Lapeer. 7 3 lead, in fact. And now Dow looking to respond. Chargers hand it off to Jamison Zimmer. He will not be denied. He gets in easy to find the pay dirt for the touchdown to put that Dow back in front. Lightning trying for it all now, looking to get the lead back. But this one picked off by Matt. Max Brandt, Midland Dow taking down Lapeer tonight, 23 to 14. Well, we're just getting started on this week's edition of Friday Night Lights. Coming up, we check in on Midland High, Mount Pleasant, Corona, and many more. Don't go anywhere. 